Hi guys, welcome back to Rugby Scrum Skills. I really hope you're enjoying my channel. If you haven't subscribed already, follow the links below, subscribe to my channel so you get all the updates. I regularly update at least once a week, so I'm trying to put out new content all the time. Today, we're gonna to look at some setup in the Mitre 10 Cup in a game between Waikato and Bay of Plenty. I wanna show you the importance of a good strong bind, and when you get a poor bind, how difficult it is to get back into shape Okay, and you really get hurt by that at scrum time and that's what the referees look at. So I hope you enjoy it and again, thanks for watching. Okay, so here's a video from the Mitre 10 Cup. Uh, Bay of Plenty in the blue and yellow and Waikato in the red, black and yellow. So this is one of the early scrums in the game. So the ball's just been fed in. So we've missed the engagement and that's just part of the replay that we get from the TV. But let's just have a look at some of the interesting points in this scrum. Okay, look at the look at the tight head. Look at his body shape. Okay, he's not in a great pushing position there. Also, he's already on the engagement, and this foot is way too far forward. That this foot needs to be back in line with his inside foot. Okay, so as we roll it through. So now we can have a look at the loose head. Okay, look at his body shape. There. Okay. It's not too bad if you have a look at it. Okay. Again, I'd like to see this foot here back in line with his other foot. Makes it easier for the hooker to get a good clean strike on it. It also helps maintain that square connection through the through the middle there. Okay, and as we go through, we've got a push coming through now from Bay of Plenty. Okay, through here. Not exactly straight, <coughs> the pressure. He's trying to get his head underneath the tight head. Okay, the tight head still hasn't reacted yet and moved his feet. He's now moved his, if you watch the tight head here, okay, here, he's moving his foot back into here. Um, it's not very clear, but I reckon he puts his foot, because the flanker doesn't have his, his feet back where they should be, okay, we've got a little bit of connection there between the Blanker's knee and the prop's foot, which then causes the prop, if you watch it closely, he's, he can't put his foot all the way down, and now the flanker's got his knee on the ground. Okay? So then as we roll it through, but now the black. Bay of Plenty props got that pressure coming forward and look at the tight head now for um, Waikato. Look at his body shape now. He's all bunched up and compressed. Okay, They're just going to get uh, annihilated from here. The flanker's still got his knee on the ground. Okay, So let's roll it through a bit more. They just keep applying pressure the tight head now has been pushed in okay by the loose head okay it's not a perfect scrum by by a plenty okay you look there there uh, pressures coming through on all different angles on their props as well it's just they're probably a little bit stronger so let me just keep rolling it through now they've got the roll on Okay, the back, the back feet here of these guys, they're just skidding, okay, as we roll through, now they've got that dominance, the ball's at the back of the scrum, okay, this prop here, um, have a look at his angles here now, he's now pushing in that way, 
Okay, so they've been totally dominated there. Okay guys, I hope you really enjoyed that video around the importance of getting a good strong bind. It just helps you to control the situation a lot more. You've got that good strong bind straight up and how important it is if you don't get a good bind that it's really difficult to get back into that good body shape and transfer your power through. Again, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, follow the links down below, visit my website. You can subscribe there as well. Uh, please feel free to comment, leave me your feedback. As always, I do try and respond to all your comments and I really enjoy the feedback. Thanks guys.